next weekend, Arsenal, Manchester United. How, how do you feel the, the dynamic of that, that famous rivalry is right now? Well, it's, it, they're in a different stage. Arsenal are expected to challenge for the league with the business that they've done. There's a lot of better pressure being put on Havertz, but I think give the lad a chance, let him settle into the team. I would say that for me, looking at Arsenal, I said it last week on Monday Night Football, there's an element of this sort of experimentation, this expectation of, you know, fullbacks think they can play midfield and midfield players think they can play fullback and parties playing sort of half and half in a game. I just think there's an element sometimes of just, if you like going back to sort of basics uh, and I'd expect next week that uh, Mikel Arteta is going to end that experiment and that he's going to probably go with a solid back four with four defenders. He'll maybe move Partey into midfield along with Rice and maybe Erdegaard. Get back to something that sort of, if you like, resembles what a team looks like. Balancing team is really important. Innovation's fantastic. We love seeing new things. However, sometimes an idea that maybe started off as a good idea somewhere evolves into something that just, to be fair, doesn't work. And I feel there's a little bit of that with Arsenal. So with Arsenal next week, I would expect them to go back to something that resembles the team that played last season with obviously the introduction of Declan Rice and get back to those sort of basics of what they are, which is a 4-3-3 team. And if they're on the ball up the pitch, if Zinchenko's left back, he pops into midfield. And then obviously Ben White right back or Tommy Asu would sort of tuck round and make that three. That will work. Uh, Manchester United are decent on the counter-attack. It's a big test for United. It's a big test for United because their performances this season so far, all three of them have been below par. And I think if you're below par at the Emirates, you're going to get beaten. So... United are going to have to rise, they're going to have to raise the game, but Arsenal, I think, are also going to have to sort themselves out and get back into a shape that I think the players will be more familiar with.